Come around, got the whole thing wobbing. What is going on YouTube? Once again, I'm here back with another video. You guys can see the title. We got ourselves some NBA Live Mobile Season 9 news that we're going to be taking a look at. Uh, if you logged on to the game today, uh, EA pretty much told us that the auction house is going to be closing very soon. We got the NBA season around the corner. The preseason is currently live right now, which means that we got ourselves a new NBA Live Mobile Season dropping soon. It's been a while, you know what I'm saying? NBA Live Mobile has been out for a minute. Me personally, I started playing NBA Live Mobile in 2016. If you go back to my earlier videos on the channel, you guys can see some of uh, the season one content that we had in NBA Live Mobile. Now we're here in 2024 and we're getting ourselves season nine. Time flies when you're having fun and uh, I'm definitely hyped for NBA Live Mobile season nine. We're going to be taking a look at what they're talking about here. And then I'm going to be sharing my thoughts on uh, some of the new features that uh, may be coming in NBA Live Mobile Season 9. So make sure to click that like button and make sure to subscribe if you guys are new. Turn on notifications because we are dropping loads of content every single day. And uh, you definitely don't want to miss any of my NBA Live Mobile Season 9 content. Alright, so uh, we got ourselves a forum right here. And uh, I'm going to leave this link down below in the description so that you guys can take a look at it for yourself. But uh, let's go ahead and take a look right here. It says NBA Live Mobile Update Season 9. Let's take a look at it, baby. So NBA Live Mobile's newest entry, Season 9, will launch later this month. Okay, it's, it's October 27th, you know what I'm saying? Which means that, you know, we're right around the corner. Uh, we will talk about what will transfer from season eight to season nine as some of its features will conclude when season eight ends. Additionally, we will discuss some details and teases on what to expect from season nine. Let's start with what will be carried forward to season nine and what will be left behind. You will keep your NBA cash and your coins. I currently have 9.5 million coins on my account. Uh, yesterday I did some gameplay with that uh, featured collection CJ McCollum. I tried to sell him for like 9 million. He didn't sell. I reposted him for 5 million. So hopefully he sells before the auction house closes. Right now the auction house is still live. So uh, I would recommend selling as uh, many players as possible so that you can go into NBA Live Mobile Season 9 stacked up and ready to go. It looks like you're going to be keeping your players as well. You guys already know about the multi-year lineup. Um, you're going to be able to use your old players uh, from the previous seasons in your multi-year lineup to uh, play showdown. You know what I mean? I, I still have like season three and season four players that have special abilities in my multi-year lineup. And uh, I've still been using them here in season eight. So uh, right here it says you can only use these as a part of uh, your multi-year lineup to gain an edge in some of our more difficult events uh like like they said you can use them at live events as well you, you the only the only place you cannot use them is your current lineup you can use them at live events though and you can use them to play showdown which is nice uh they will not be a part of any other lineup like they said you're going to be able to keep your jerseys you're going to be able to keep your courts and you're going to be able to keep your boost items any additional players, jerseys, courts, and boost items that put your account above the item limit currently set at 1350. The item limit used to be 1200, now it's 1350, which is nice. Um, like they said though, any items that are above 1350 items will be removed, okay? It is in your best interest to, cur to curate your collection, including removing any additional items from sets to ensure that you have all the items you would most you would most like to keep. During the season eight rollover, items above the item limit will be removed and converted into credits. You guys know about the uh, the credits that you that you use for pro packs. That's what they're talking about. Okay. All the items that you're not using are just going to be turned into credits and then you'll be able to use those credits to open up packs in NBA Live Mobile Season 9. <clears throat> Beginning with the lowest tier items and scaling upwards, we do not have a specific breakdown of the credits per item as it will vary. More details will be shared later. So that is everything that we will be keeping and rolling over into NBA Live Mobile Season 9. I like that. 
uh, like I said, man, make sure to sell as many players as you can so that uh, you could go into season nine stacked up and ready to go. I currently have nine million. Hopefully my CJ McCollum sells. Uh, I still have a lot of like 105s and stuff that I can sell. So uh, what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna post up everything and then I'm I'm probably gonna do a selling my bench video if everything sells so that we could see how many coins we could claim before NBA Live Mobile Season 9 drops. So this is uh, what we will not keep, all right? So you will not keep your collectibles, your styles items, your collectibles and style items will not carry over to season nine. To ensure you are rewarded for the hard work you put into earning these, each item will be converted into credits during a rollover. These credits can be used in season nine to purchase store packs that will give you a head start, like I said. The number of credits you will receive for season eight is based on the value of items on your account. Uh, these are the calculations right here. Uh, 10,000 coins right here, like these are the quick sell tokens. Uh, it's going to be one credit. Bronze token gives you a credit. Silver token, two credits. Uh, gold token uh, gives you three. Elite tokens give you four. Ultra tokens give you five. Royal tokens give you six. And super tokens give you seven. Okay, so that stuff's going to add up. I have a lot of collectibles that I'm not using on my bench. And uh, that, that, that is going to add up for me. And uh, we're going to be stacked with credits. Uh, going into the next season so um as we conclude season eight we will be closing the auction house and the ability to post any new auctions uh on october 25th right now it's the 27th and the auction house is still open so i'm assuming today may be the last day the auction house is open and then tomorrow is going to be closed uh like i said before i recorded this video i posted up cj mccullum again and uh you know the auction house is still live so what I'm assuming is uh, today the auction house is going to be closing. Well, I would say today will be the last day of the auction house. Once, right, when, right when the game you know updates tomorrow, the auction house is probably going to be closed. So try to post your auctions up today. Sell some players because today is most likely the last day. They said the 25th. Right now it's the 27th. So take advantage of the auction house being open today. Preparing for tip-off. We're right around the corner, guys. I'm extremely hyped for it. We must temporarily take the game servers offline to ensure the smooth sailing of the latest content. Don't fret, though. Starting a few days before launch, ooh, excuse me, this planned downtime will pave the way for a seamless and stable gaming experience. Stay tuned for upcoming announcements on how this will unfold while the game takes a short pause. Connect with us on our social media platforms Follow us for exciting updates and be the first to know when season nine comes live. Thank you for understanding and patience as we work diligently to deliver the latest content. We can't wait for you to experience the new chapter soon. So that's all we got so far today. Today and pretty much next week is, is it. So get your teams right. Uh, we got the final promo that's currently out right now. Once that promo ends, season nine will be live. All right, so uh, get your teams right. You're going to be able to keep your players, get your coins right. You're going to be able to keep your coins. I currently have over 10,000 NBA cash no money spent that we're going to be carrying over into season nine. So I'm stacked up. I'm ready to go. Uh, the final player we're going to be adding to the team is uh, the Deadly Dreamers, Valanchunez. There's also that James Harden that's out there that we want to get as well. So uh, if we could add both of those players to the team before uh, the season ends, then I'm a happy camper. We're currently sitting at a 111 overall, and uh, I want to get up to like a 113. No money spent before the season ends. Comment down y'all's overalls down below. Comment down if you guys are hyped, and uh, let me know what you guys want to see in NBA Live Mobile Season 9. That's going to wrap it up for this video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to click that like button. Make sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.